My name is Justin Cordy. I work for the City Utility Saskatoon Light and Power as a power line technician. In my opinion, a power line technician is uh, job is to supply electricity and power to anybody that requests it. Our job is to maintain and build power lines both overhead and underground to supply electricity to businesses, um, recreational centers, hospitals, traffic lights, street lights to in the night. Our job is quite extensive. We do a lot of things behind the scenes that keep the electricity going. We are constantly updating our infrastructure to better our voltage um, and better the uh, supply for customers. And yeah, I mean, there's a lot that goes into that, uh, a lot of training. Uh, we operate heavy equipment. We also get called out when power voltage uh, is, goes out during a storm, we have to restore power. So that's the responsibility as a power line technician. So a typical work day, it, the best thing about being a power line technician working for the utility is that there really isn't a typical day. Um, every day is, is different. Sometimes you're, you're installing street lights, sometimes you're installing power poles, sometimes you're installing a service line for a new business. Um, sometimes you're restoring power for a power outage. Sometimes you're setting poles in the ground. Every day is a different day, um, which is the true beauty of being a power line technician in the utility. My experience before becoming a power line technician kind of got me ready for the role as a power line technician. I worked many different business, uh, jobs in the trades. Um, I worked in carpentry, I worked in the glass business, I fabricated metal and steel. My dad was a carpenter, I learned a lot through my dad. Uh, I always knew that I wanted a physical job, outdoor job, and uh, something that you know made me feel good at the end of the day that I accomplished something. What really drove me to become a power line technician um, was you know I met a friend in my early 20s and he was a power line technician. That's when I really learned what a power line technician does. And I was really intrigued by the job. It sounded really cool. And I just set myself up to learn as much as I could about the business and got involved in any way that I could. The training involved in becoming a power line technician um, is, is more self-centered. It's, it's you, you do your research on the business and uh, learning a little bit about electricity circuits and how that stuff works, uh, enjoying outdoors, and physical activity um, is a good stepping stone for becoming a power line technician. Um, there are many opportunities, whether it's contractors, utilities, SAS power, um, where they will train you uh, to become a power line technician. You will follow a boot camp where they'll test your skills to begin with. And if your skills are mechanically and physically up to the standards of the business, then they'll give you a shot at an apprenticeship and then they'll put you through a four-year apprenticeship course where you'll go to school yearly in those four years and you'll learn your skills uh, based on your job. A good fit for this profession is somebody who has some work experience and a great level of maturity. Um, there is a lot on the line, there's some dangers involved in, in power lining and there's a lot of teamwork where you have the responsibility of a fellow brother or sister in the role that you're playing. So you have to be responsible, you have to be a level-headed individual, and you have to be, you know, mature and, and physically fit and up to your daily tasks. I love my job because of the team aspect, the people that I've met uh, in, in my same job field the brotherhood and sisterhood that comes with the job the teamwork is just what what i love there's it's not just a one person team this is a team effort where everyone gets together uses their head to construct a plan and safety uh first so we we that's that's the fav my favorite part of it i also enjoy working outdoors working with my hands building things and I think that uh, being a power line technician, there's a lot of responsibility and it, it lets you feel good at the end of the day when you've accomplished something, you've restored power to a building or you, you came in on a storm on a, on a call and it, it just makes you feel good. That's really what I enjoy about it.
If I was a student looking into power line technician, I think that there's a, a great amount of opportunity in the field. I think that it's an ever-growing field or industry. Um, electricity is kind of the, the powerful subject right now. And I feel like there's a lot of job security um, and with infrastructure constantly getting updated and growing, we're constantly renewing and rebuilding uh, the infrastructure. And I think that it's, it's only going to get better and bigger. The advice I'd give to a high school student looking uh, to work in the trades or as a power line technician is to, to really reach out and study what you're after, to find out what it is that you're good at, to really hone in on your skills and chase the dream that you have and really study and work towards it. Um, I think that's the most beneficial thing. It shows some maturity and uh, some drive in yourself. And uh, that's my best advice, is just to, to go after it and, and be headstrong and, and fight for what you want. Yeah, I think someone seeking a job in Powerline, it needs to understand that you're not always working with high voltage. You're not, like there's, there's so many things involved in being a Powerline technician. You, you learn how to operate heavy equipment, such as cranes, large bucket trucks. You spend a lot of time up in the air, so if, if heights are an issue, then, then maybe that's not set for you. Um, but yeah, there's so many different tasks, like sometimes you're digging trenches and installing pipe and uh, um, the field has a lot of uh, tasks, like daily tasks that, you, that you're involved with. So it's not just working with high voltage, there's a lot of fun stuff involved in power lining.